I've been on top for a while. $30 for shipping. Not me. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the vlog. Y'all, I'm looking atrocious right now. Um, I don't even think I washed my face. You know what? Let me come back with a proper introduction because I said in 2024, I'm going to do better. I'll be back. <laughs> they're making repairs to my roof um anyway i don't know what to wear like i know i'm looking at clothes i really wanted to put on like a real outfit and not just tights and a t-shirt but y'all i'm so fat that i can't fit into a lot of um options as far as pants so it does look like i'm gonna be put on on some tights maybe maybe this might work this is kind of you know what we saving it for i might put that on but i am putting the head on so i don't know i guess y'all see what i'll finally find in a second hey girl hey what's up welcome back to another vlog um i am back y'all i did finally figure something to put on it is super humid outside if you're new here hey girl hey my name is anitra renee i love to film lifestyle vlogs girly hauls and store shop with me um decorating videos anything pretty much has to do with home decor and lifestyle so me and the girlies would love for you to be a part of the tribe don't forget to subscribe before you leave um y'all i've decided to pick up the camera because um i got some things going on today um i did order uh this shoe rack at the beginning of the little montage before I came on here and properly introduced myself. Um, 
I, I'm going to show y'all what I'm sick of on my way out. I'm going to show y'all what I'm sick of, but I've been wanting to order, uh, you know, the shoe racks that pretty much hide your shoes. So, I finally uh, pulled the trigger on that and uh, ordered that on Amazon. I didn't want to pay for the $30 shipping, but it does say um, you can return it. I'm not sure if the return is free, though. So... I'm praying that I like it and it works out. I took the measurements um, and I think it will. But nevertheless, um, if y'all hear stuff, they are um, putting a new roof on, which is a whole nother story in itself. A whole lot of money. Um, it is some downfalls with home ownership. Of course, um, there are some um, good things about it as well. But we'll go into that at a later date i finally found something to put on um i guess i'll turn around here i'm thinking today is going to be like a cleanup day um i did wash my hair i've been up since like 4 30 in the morning um it's loud so i'm probably just going to talk to y'all when i get in the car because we do need to run around but i need to be back before my contractor gets here and he's going to get here i think by 11 30 so we have just a little under two hours to head and do the things that we need to do. So I'm going to pick y'all up on the way. Okay, y'all. Um, I just realized that it is past um, 10. It is like almost 10, 15. And I was hoping to be out of the house before that time. So I could be back. But we really only have like an hour and then I may have to just come back um, to the other stores that I wanted to go to later. And I do need to stop by the freaking grocery store and get um, some more tomatoes for some guacamole. So I'll do that on the way back. But I'm hungry. We are definitely about to stop at Chick-fil-A and grab a little something something. As a matter of fact, let me just go ahead and put it on the app. I had ordered a new uh, sticker mount thing, but it's a little bit smaller than what's on here. So I don't know if it's going to work. I'm going to try it once I um, wipe my th surface down. You know, the, the thing up here, dashboard. Um, but let me order this food and let's see what we're going to go first. Probably going to go to Macy's first because I need to return or something. We're definitely gonna do that and I need a new eyebrow pencil so I don't know if I'm gonna have time to go to home goods but we gonna stretch it y'all we need to be back literally in an hour baby got a spot right in the front look at God he looking out today no I'm in a rush <laughs> Y'all, when I tell y'all I spent way too much time up in Macy's, like I, I did the return as I was supposed to, and I got another eyebrow pencil. They didn't have the uh, dip brow gel. I don't know what's up with them. The girl was like, she's not sure if they stopped making it or what. Um, but that's like my third time asking, so I'm probably back at pencil using a pencil um if anybody else uses max like a uh, dip bra gel let me know where i can find it i was thinking maybe dillard's um i don't have time today i gotta get back to this house i gotta get back to this house and we running behind time but um 
I am going to make a stop up in Home Goods since it is across the way. I'm just going to have to be a little late. I was hoping to be um, back by 11.30. I think he said he's going to be there by 11. So I'm thinking I'm probably going to get there right at 11.30, 11.40. There's, um, it's not your turn, buddy. Um, I want some coffee. I'm all over the place. I wanted to go make this donation, but I don't have time. So, yeah, we'll probably have to do that next Friday or sometime during the week. Um, I just don't have a lot of time. And when I get back to the house, I have to clean up. Like, I need to clean up. So, unless I step out later on today or do it tomorrow, um, like, run the rest of these little runs. Because I'm looking for these baskets. Um... I have to show you all the baskets that I'm looking for um, on screen here. And I saw them a couple of weeks ago at Home Goods Marshalls, like all together store. And I did not get them. I was like, I need these, but what do I need them for? And then I just had an epiphany this morning when I woke up at 430 what I needed the baskets for. I was like, I needed those baskets for my freaking pillows on my bed when I make my bed, you know? And my extra blankets in my bedroom. But needless to say, child, I didn't get them. Um, so I'm pretty sure they probably don't have them. And this is a totally different home goods that, um, from where I saw them in. But anyway, we're gonna run in here real quick. I'm gonna cross my fingers and maybe they'll have them, maybe they won't. Maybe this store won't be too crowded. Sorry, girls. I don't think this is going to be like a shot with me this time. But maybe tomorrow. I'm not going to even lie. This store looks crowded. This one, actually, this one might match my bedroom better. Um, but I was looking for it in that color with this top. So let me see how much this one is here. Look like the small one is $39.99. That's not gonna hurt nothing. I need this size and the larger size. I really need the larger size. This one's 40. It's really not gonna hold much of anything. I don't know, y'all. Do I just wait? I'll just get this one and see if it will work out for right now. I might do that. Stop the marshes and look what they have the brown one. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and get it. And I already bought that one. I bought that one. Then I'm black. Hey y'all, I am back home finally. I didn't get a chance to eat my breakfast that I picked up on the boat. It really is still like brunch time. Just now 12.30, my contractor said he should be here by 12.20, and he's not here yet, so I beat him. That's good. Um, I'm gonna heat this up and eat this. I just got some eggs and grilled chicken. Y'all know I'm still trying to be on the Weight Watchers and lose a few pounds. Um, we stopped by Marshall's and I did pick up that wallet. I'll show you guys again in a minute. And then I also picked up, I'm gonna put this all in one. I also picked up this coffee um, syrup that I wanna try. 
it says zero calories, I believe it said that, or either zero sugars. It might be both sugar. Zero calories says zero sugars, but I'm gonna give it a go. Let me heat this up. Here, I'm making a mess. And they ran out of jalapeno salsa at Chick-fil-A. Y'all, this jalapeno salsa is so good. But they gave me two extra ones last time. So I was like, definitely we'll be keeping those to eat at home. I love me salsa on my eggs. And my battery would be going dead. Okay, I think I left the other one in the car. Let me eat this and then I'm going to show y'all that coffee syrup I picked up. Um, from Marshalls and the uh, Steve Man Clutch and then also I finally got my order from Zara. I was looking at my mailbox and I was like they said it was delivered and nothing was in there but it was left at my doorstep and of course I haven't been outside because they've been doing work on my roof. You know it has been a hazmat zone over here. A uh, hard hat zone should I say but um let me eat this breakfast because your girl is starving. Okay, ladies and gents, we are back for a little haul here. Um, they finished my roof. However, my contractor is coming back to do my um, sheetrock. So I had already eaten. It is a little bit later in the day. It's like four o'clock, like 4.30. So I said I was gonna come back. Oh, let me see if I can make this a little brighter and show y'all what I picked up in Marshalls. I showed you I had that wallet in my girly haul, um, which is a couple, I think, videos back. Um, and also on my pink page, I showed the different colors of this one and also in store here when I was just now. I picked up the pink one and I initially was going to get the brown one. It's like a brown taupey color. It's not all the way chocolate chocolate, but it's like a brown taupey color. Uh, I love these because they do have, it's like a wristlet wallet. So when you don't want to carry a big purse and you just want your important things like your phone and credit card. This was $16.99. It comes in such cute uh, packaging for the box to be in. And as if I probably needed any more coffee syrups, but given the fact that I've been kind of limiting myself on the amount of syrup that I'm putting in a coffee because I'm trying to cut some calories to lose some weight, I decided to try this one here it's called a uh, caramel pecan. It sounded good. It's sugar free, so you know it's gonna be that alternative um, sugar. I'm looking at it right now. Uh, sucralose is what it's got. Um, it's zero everything. So I hope it's good. I hope it doesn't have like that aftertaste. I like some sugar-free things, but some sugar-free things just have that aftertaste. Um, it was $5.499. But what is most important is this right here. I ordered these shoes. Tell me why I didn't get them when I uh, initially saw them, which was weeks ago. I did an Instagram reel like of the spring um decor that I should have did a nah I should have did a unboxing video. Let me see if it's too late. I'll be right back y'all. what's up it is the very next day sunday um i just ended up actually shooting it real my contractor came back to fix my ceiling now um it's about 12 30 uh sunday y'all this house i got to it's just stuff like out of place and that's why i can't find anything 
and I want to like just clear it and see a free space. So um, I want to finish doing some of the things that I didn't get an opportunity to do yesterday. One of which is go to Old Navy. I ordered these tights and they are too like short. They're, I always wear tights like this in the um, summertime. And see the shorts, I don't have a problem with the shorts. The pants are just too, like the leggings, um, they're too short. So I want to go get my $70 and some change back for that. Um, I've got this Easter decor still that I need to figure out how am I and where am I putting it. I have a bin outside, but I'm going to have to do some reorganizing. So we're going to do that today. Um, I didn't get an opportunity yesterday. I did eat leftovers, but I wanted to make some guacamole with my leftovers. And I don't think I have any more as I think about it. I cook like this, um, cook like some chicken tenders and some bell peppers. Kind of like a, you know, fajita bowl or whatever. I'm looking to see. I've got like literally a corner left. <laughs> I've got literally a corner left of leftovers but i want to make some guacamole i gotta figure out what i'm gonna eat for the remainder of the week um i do have some groceries in here because you know i went to the grocery store a couple weeks ago but um uh, anyway i made this bomb like bowl um last week i think i want to do that again but i want to make it with shrimp so i'm gonna stop by heb i think get some shrimp get some more tomatoes for guacamole um, a few more items. I need to make my list, but it's like no more than like five or six items that I need to get. I want to come back. I have a couple of dishes to put up and like about four dishes to wash. I need to wash those. I need to, to figure out where this Easter decor is going. That's been sitting on my island here. It's like, I'm tired of looking at it. Um, I do need to mop my floors and sweep them. I want to sweep and mop my restroom floors. Um, kind of like just got a few things to pick up in here and then I may, I may, depending on how I feel, like, let me cut this light out. I've been wanting to, um, kind of redecorate. It's looking a little plain right now. I've been wanting to kind of redecorate, reorganize, situate, um, uh, I'm trying to say this bookcase anyway right here and then that's why I was shooting my little reel slash I think I'm gonna put some flowers I'm just gonna do try to make probably do a couple of IG videos I do have another vlog to edit which I'll probably be doing that today later on so it's late let me stop rambling let's get on out of here and I'm gonna take y'all to the store with me
Straight to a penthouse, Miami Beach. Yeah, yo. Talk crazy on tweets. Who? They don't want it cause I come to defeat. They don't want it. I beat the new thoughts sweet. sweet. Bamboo sticks out in the Jeep. Blue, blue. It's a new weirdo every week. Weirdo. Get the work, put it up for my seeds. No care for the IG. Just no care. Do anything for club. Do anything, do anything for club. Do anything for club. Hey guys i am finally 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 back home it is like almost six o'clock tell me how i went to heb i went to the grocery store to get literally i had my list like five things uh it was shrimp it was tomatoes it was olive oil um eggs and one other thing y'all how i went there to basically spend $25 and spent 105 yeah I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know what happened so these are the groceries that I got with my $104 I might as well do a little grocery haul for y'all <laughs> I need to clean up this kitchen. I did say I'm going to clean up this kitchen for the end of the night. Um, and I went to get the shrimp to make the stir fry. I think I showed y'all. Um, or no, I showed y'all what I had left over. But let me see what I'm going to set y'all up. Because y'all, I really need to clean up this kitchen. That is the last thing we're going to do tonight. Is clean the kitchen. You know, wipe down everything. Put up everything. Wash the dishes. And mop the floors. I am doing that tonight if i don't do anything else that is going to get done for sure tonight so time for the grocery haul here we go let me just go ahead and sit the camera down here i'm gonna go ahead and wipe everything off too you know i got this beef broth and i probably already got some i know i bought a can I'm actually glad I did buy it because I don't have none. I thought I had some and I was getting it just in case, but I got the shrimp. The shrimp was on sale. That man gave me a little bit more than a pound. You know, I don't be trying to be too much of a stickler, but I asked for a pound because a pound was $6.97. I was trying to spend a little extra because I think one of them came out to be eight. So I got two pounds. I'm going to go ahead and put those up in the freezer where is the other one i always like to get my shrimp get your shrimp on ice ask for a bag of ice i don't care if it is cold outside especially ask for it on ice when it's hot outside because you don't want your shrimp to be cooking on your way home so got the two pounds of shrimp let me see i'm just gonna put, I'm gonna put everything out on the counter so y'all can get a visual. Okay, you guys. Here is all the hundred and five dollar <laughs> groceries that I bought. A hundred and five, which is crazy because I feel like I just spent two hundred dollars at the grocery store a couple of weeks ago, and I got more groceries. But I don't know. Nevertheless, I know these pecans are high. I love these, y'all. These are the honey toasted uh, pecans. Now I know that they are high on my Weight Watchers points, but y'all, this is my like only guilty pleasure aside from my coffee. I did get um, this Bridgerton. It's called English Toffee. I don't know why it's not focusing, but it's called English Toffee. I've been wanting to try it. It was $4. 
So I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and try it now. Um, we're gonna see what this soy sauce. I forgot the god dog on soy sauce at H E B and I had to stop by Aldi. If you've ever shopped at Aldi before, then you know they have some name brand stuff and some stuff is not. Um, I hope this is okay because I do want to do the stir fry. And then I wanted um I love this vinaigrette uh dressing, it's pretty good. I wanna say I think it's like it may be low in points, so I'm gonna check it out. But I wanted an alternative aside from using uh, my Chick fil A avocado um, dressing. I love these Alani News. This is my favorite. This is like uh, the blueberry one, it's called Breezeberry. It's a substitute for like Red Bull, basically, an energy drink. Had to pick me up some more salsa. That was the cheapest <laughs> nothing to do. I picked up some fruit in um, Aldi because I forgot I did want to get me some more fruit. I had gotten some watermelon a couple weeks ago and it really wasn't good. I have a couple of slices left and then um, I have a few grapes left so I wanted to get some more. These are so good. They're zero in points, zero everything. Um, I think five calories but zero sugar because it is that faux sugar. <laughs> I don't even know if that's good, but zero and only five calories. And then, of course, I got my produce. I'm going to make some more of those bowls. So I had to get some more bell peppers. I want to make um, some salmon and mashed potatoes and spinach, which I did not get. I'm trying to think. Maybe I'll make green beans with it because I think I do have some green beans. I got this broccoli to add some additional broccoli into my stir fry to make it, you know, a little bit more filling. And I'll probably add some corn as well. Got some more cilantro um, for my bowls. And then I got the dill for the salmon. I'm going to make a lemon dill cream sauce with it. I think it would be so good with like mashed potatoes and spinach. And then of course, I, this was on the list to get some tomatoes for the guacamole. Um, now this olive oil, I like to use this for Weight Watchers because it is zero. I do put a little bit of this from time to time. This is not zero because that is the real deal and that is not. Um, I have eggs in the morning. Love eggs. I might even try to make me some avocado toast and some eggs. I think that might be good uh, if I just figure it out. Now, I've been wanting to do like um, beef tips. Like not beef tips and gravy, but just like beef tips. Maybe over mashed potatoes. So, I thought this was a good price for these. Um, it says extra uh, lean boneless 804 y'all know beef is high period but I didn't want to do like a, a ribeye and chop it up because I would have had to do like a thick ribeye but you know this is kind of like the mixed beef not the top top but I thought that was a good price to do that and then I can get like for real for real if I do like mashed potatoes um, I prefer mashed potatoes over rice, although I do still eat, like, I like the jasmine rice, but I could get three meals really off of this, so, um, not bad. Then I got me some wings. I want to do me some wings in the air fryer and try those out, like some hot wings and some lemon pepper wings, and maybe even some regular ring wings. I'm gonna go ahead and open these up and rinse them off once I put up those dishes. Um, so I like to go ahead and even up all of my packets of everything before I put them in the freezer because I'm not about to cook that right now. Then I did end up getting some more bacon and I picked that up from Aldi with the um, with the dressing and the uh, soy sauce and the fruit. And then I got some more chicken tenders to make more fajita bowls and whatever else. I want to make some hot honey chicken tenders. So I've been wanting to make some and I think I'm gonna try to make them in the air fryer. So we shall see how they turn out. And then I don't feel like cooking tonight. So I did buy me a bowl from uh, Um Burrito. I don't know if it's, I call it Um Burrito. It's probably you Burrito. I, I put a clip of me rolling out from there. But let me go ahead and wash these dishes so I can go ahead and even up this meat and put it up in the freezer. Cause honey, we got to do something with my hair tonight. I definitely have to flat iron my hair. Because I plan on putting it in like a little bun or something. And I have a haul to film. Which will be way out before this video. Um, I have like five videos to edit. So I got to get that done. But we are definitely cleaning this kitchen tonight. Uh, before tonight is over with. But yeah.
rinse, hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit, ooh. And I know your taste is a little bit, ooh, high maintenance, ooh. Everybody else basic, we live life on an everyday basis. We're poetic justice, poetic justice. If I told you that a flower bloomed in the dark, ooh, trust it, I mean I write poems in these songs. Dedicated to you in join the moon for him, but they just blood in my pen. Better yet with your friends and them. I really wanna know you all, I really wanna show you all. honey i am ready to finally dig into my food because i got the dishes washed this part of the countertop is clean i'll probably have to wipe this again after i get through assembling my food i gave my fruits just another rinse again and i'll put this stuff up when it dries and I need to put it in a container, the fruit. But yes, I can finally get into this. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all see me? I'm shaking. I'm shaking, 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 shaking. And then I got the Serrano Ranch and the spicy avocado. Y'all, I'm about to dig into this food. Look at a little bit of television. I need to charge my little wireless lights. But yeah. Time to eat, baby. Than price like guarantee, which has made him a bit uh, unruly. You called yourself the uncarrier. You're sick about the price like on those commercials. The first the bag, the first bag. So if you can check the real, we could all VH1. this whole session. <laughs> y'all, why y'all ain't tell me? I'm over there looking like why I finished eating. I was like, something don't feel right. I was like, my nail popped off. I was like, my friends didn't tell me that my nail popped off in the vlog. Oh, huh? uh, I hope this nail didn't pop off in my food while I'm eating because I'm like, it was on. I'm over here on the counter. I'm like, my nail was on when I was rinsing everything off. So I'm like, where did the nail go? <sighs> Y'all, this battery is going dead. Um. Mm. Yeah, okay. I don't know where my nail popped off at. That's a shame. 